I am François Ribeiro, head of Discovery Sport Events, the promoter of the Speedway Grand Prix, the Speedway GP. We are going to give you a tour, a backstage of our job as a promoter, explain you what we are doing to produce that type of event. We are in Warsaw. We have 54,000 fans behind me supporting the Polish riders and Discovery Sport Events is leading this. Around me I have kids. This is a really special day because we have kids from Ukraine and Poland. We invite in them at that event to give them a bit of a smile on their face. Some of them told me it was the best day of my life. And this is, look, the national anthem is going to start and look at what we are doing. Half of the stadium is Polish, half of the stadium is Ukrainian. This is something absolutely unique. We are unlocking the power of sport and this is what we are doing. We are super proud of this. So here we are, the racing backstage. This is the push-off area. All the bikes will come here and line up four by four before they enter the track. Um, when they are there, just before entering the track, we will project on screen their uh, racing number, their uh, classifications, even live telemetry, their heartbeat to see how they react before going on track. Um, and Discovery Sport events, since we became promoter of the championship, we really try hard to elevate the, the, the presentation of that championship. So we have built new pit boxes, which uh, we are going to visit. Come with me. So we have built from scratch 16 boxes, which are going from one event to the other. Um, it's very good presentation. We are not so far from the MotoGP standards, frankly speaking. Each rider has a box. They come with their two bikes. This is the bikes of the World Champion 2021. Each box is equipped with pit cameras over there to give uh, a different experience on OTT uh, to the fans. The riders are coming with their mechanics and so on, but it's all branded with our sponsors. It's all equipped, it's all connected. The, the, the riders can follow the race here uh, on screen. Today is a bit of a special day because we have invited, in coordination with our friends from, from TVN Poland, we have decided to invite 100 kids from Ukraine to give them a good experience, a good moment. Uh, so they're gonna stay the entire afternoon they are connected with the riders, they can they receive a cap, autograph from them, and then they're going to go to the fan zone and they are going to stay with us the whole evening. Um, and I think it's, uh, it's something really we wanted to do, try to bring a, a smile on their face because those kids, uh, they are all between 10 and 14, have been suffering a lot. Most of them came with their mother only, that stay sadly in the country. Um, and look at them, it's, it's, it's really cute. They all have a, a, a cap and, uh, and now I think they are going to the fan zone. Speedway GP is not like MotoGP. There is no the likes of Honda, Yamaha, Kawasaki, Suzuki. It's only a story between fans and riders. And that story starts here in the fan zone. We are just three hours before we open the gates and all the riders are there and in the middle of that fan zone to give fans the, the, the opportunity to have autograph sessions with them, uh, get a souvenir, get a selfie from them play music, win goodies. We want to give them a good experience. This is exactly what we are doing. Logistics are absolutely key to the success of uh, Speedway GP operations and the, the leadership of Discovery Sport Events. So we have 14 trucks like this. SGP is like a circus that we are moving from town to town. We are loading in those trucks 50 tons of equipment and 800 meter cubes. That's quite a lot of, uh, of equipment. 
and um, we have um, a logistic partner coming from Poland helping us to move all that stuff within Europe from one country to the other. So we are in the TV production area. Discovery Sport Events is the promoter of the championship, but we need someone to produce the world feed. And we took the decision um, internally for the first time ever in the history of Discovery Sport Events to produce Speedway GP World Feed 100% in-house with the TV production resources and staff from our colleagues in Poland, TVN. Probably half of the population, of the pop Polish population have Speedway at heart, but that proportion goes much higher <laughs> inside TVN when it comes to Speedway. So we thought we could not miss the opportunity to give them the responsibility to produce the world feed, which is going on Discovery Plus, which is going on TTV, which is going on TVN, which is going on TVN24, which is going in Denmark on our free-to-air channels, which is going on British Eurosport, which is going in Sweden. It's a product which we have decided not to sub-license, to keep the value inside the group and, and maximize the activation plan, the broadcast activation plan across OTT, cable and free to wear. This is really something, uh, probably the first time we really thought about OTT and digital first. Um, and, and I give you a tour of how we are going to produce that world feed with, with our colleagues from, from TVN. Come with me. This is the broadcast center. This is really a mix of TVN employees, Discovery Sport Events employees. They are all going to produce the world feed tonight. We have about 40 cameras in total, trackside cameras, cable cam, rail camera, uh, Jimmy Jeep, steady cam. 40 different feeds will come into that broadcast center. This is our live uh, director, production manager. Uh, the producer is, is be sitting behind. Um, and we are going to deliver that feed across the entire uh, Warner Post Discovery Sports Network. Um, it's quite an excitement to think that this is the, the first event that we are producing really 100% with in-house resources. It's, it feels really special. So this is 5 o'clock. We are two hours before the start of the race, one hour before opening the gate. It's still very quiet, but two hours from now, 54,000 people will be watching the man sitting in that position. He's the referee of the competition, is the guy controlling the starting procedure. Next to the referee timekeeping team, this is brought by Discovery Sport Events. So all the bikes are equipped with uh, transponders and we have two loops in the, um, in the, on the track. They are going to collect data and telemetry, so heartbeat, top speed, acceleration, reaction time, all those data is coming into the software here, will be turned into TV graphics, which will go into the TV compound, which we have just visited, and will go on SGP app. It's a new app that we have launched. We wanted to improve the digital experience and all the live scoring, all the telemetry will be available for fans during the competition as racing is going. So exactly in the same fashion than the UCI Track Champions League, if you remember, there is a show caller. So the show caller is the one who is synchronized with the floor manager who is going to send all the riders on track on time, synchronized with the live director, synchronized with the referee of the competition. And the show caller is running, is, is, is following exactly a running order. We are exactly on the minute. The show starts precisely at 7 p.m. and finishes sharp at 10 p.m. and the show caller is going to send on screen all the information for the spectators. He's controlling also all the sound environment. He's controlling what goes on the giant screens, on the jumbo screens to entertain the fans and keep them informed. This is a very, very, very important part of Discovery Sport Events setup. That's something we brought to the competition again to elevate the, 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 the fan experience, but also the viewer experience. Um, 
we bring our own equipment, we have developed our own software, we produce our own content, we have produced all the content in-house uh, with Star Team at, at Eurosport, at Discovery Sport, and, um, and, we, and they are going to push content across the evening and also be in control of the opening and closing ceremonies. Discovery Sport Events is the host broadcaster, the producer of the Speedway GP World Feed. So we are just at the exit of the track and we will pick up the riders immediately after the performance to get their reaction, to get their feeling. So we will have a pit reporter interviewing them live after, after each uh, hit. And uh, this is, I guess, where most of the emotion of the riders will come from when they take up their helmet. Joy, tears is part of the sport. This is the starting line. Everything starts and will finish here. A company from Denmark came six days ago to set up that 250 meters track. Below my two feet, there is 5,000 tons of dirt to build that temporary track. And that track tomorrow will be dismantled and move on to Cardiff, our next big event in the Millennium Stadium. Discovery Sport Events is bringing on each event, that central stage. This is the stage we have built to run the opening ceremony, the closing ceremony. We have put a huge amount of big LED screens to interact with fans. So they will get immediately, as the riders are crossing the line, they will immediately get the results. We are even going to do a firework at the end of the, of the event. Uh, it's quite a a big setup. It's two years that that event could not happen because of COVID. So I think tonight is going to be very, very special. Um, with fans absolutely eager to come back in the stadium, have a good moment together and enjoy the best evening of a Speedway.